It's my egg! Hello and welcome to episode 23 of It's My Egg. And this week it's my egg. Nailed it. Ooh. I have got homemade scotch egg, vegetarian, or actually called vegetabilarian. I ordered these oh, from, from the, the internet. internet. Oh. 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 <laughs> Look at those! They're giant! Oh, and the beers are Lagunitas IPA. Yeah. What? So what's in these? Chickpeas, there's cheese, sun-dried tomatoes and... Ooh, that sounds quite nice. Eight. Oh, are they the ones you go to eat 17? Ooh. Oh, that's hefty. That does not rattle and it doesn't really crumb. That's uh, both good signs. First bite. Ah. Ooh. Mmm! Mmm! Oh, I can taste the tomato. Is this real meat? I can't tell. Or is it like mm. the vegetarian because it's well, got vegetables not. in? No, it's got a little B sign next to it as well. Yeah, I think Holly Bune, our vegetarian Catholic friend, had one of these. And, and she was like, no, that's got meat in it. I don't believe it. These are the best scotch eggs I've ever had off the internet. Nice yolk as well. Natural colour. Easily the best vegetarian scotch egg. I would not had. know this was not meat. You, you should tell yeah. this story, really. It's your yeah. screw up. After our blasphemous Easter special. God punishing you. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. Right, but earlier my phone had stopped working. I was like, oh, probably just a minor punishment from our Lord and Saviour. Go around uh, a roundabout a little bit quickly in the rain. And then Luke said, uh, I think you're skidding, mate. <laughs> <laughs> and I was like, pump, pump the bre... Oh, oh, no, yeah. it's not working. <laughs> Off the roundabout. <laughs> Up the curb, down yeah. the curb. Into a nice clump it's of brambles. brambles. <laughs> yeah. Climbed out and a few people had stopped, including this woman. Like <laughs> That who, woman. Bless her. She was like, here, have a jumper. And she checked me a jumper. I was like, oh, I've already got one. It's okay. And she was like, have another one. I was like, oh, thanks, thanks. And I, I went to put it on and a pair of pants fell out of it. <laughs> But then the next day, like I woke up in alone in the house, my phone was broken, Aww. the car was in a bush, <laughs> and then uh, there was a power cut. God hates you. I started it, to be fair. <laughs> and when's the last time you guys saw each other? A couple of years. <laughs> Five or six years it's or something. It's been a while then. Mm. Yeah. Well, it's got yeah. eggs, they bring people well, together. Because I love hummus, obviously. You no, know, who doesn't love hummus? It's brilliant. <laughs> I am middle class. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> It looks like there's cleavage in the little thumbnail, you click on it, and it's just a 14 year old boy talking. And it's actually his bottom. <laughs> it turns like a picture of his bum in a brow. <laughs> yeah, and no one fell for it. He <laughs> <laughs> looked like an ass. <laughs> <laughs> You're a stamp guy now, aren't you? You go all the way over the world with your stamps. Not anymore, though. Oh. I, I explain stamp guy. It makes you sound like you work in a post office. Buyer, seller, wheeler, dealer of the stamp world, or are you like a... Exactly. Like a... Like, like a Del boy of stamps. Yeah. <laughs> I had to bring some stamps in and try and... Import, export. Yes, yeah, by... And pay the it's least like amount diamond. of um, <laughs> duty possible. <laughs> so it was cheaper to fly you than to send and, them. And they still caught me. But yes! <laughs> <laughs> they, got uh, they scan my bag and it's just full of paper. And I'm like, how did you get into this? Are you, yeah, are you that, into stamps? Is it like, not like, at school? That was yeah, my secret passion. <laughs> <laughs> like, but yeah. no one was looking. I used to just get them out. And like, well, how does one fall into this? Yeah. Needing a job, I think, is. Um, yeah. Graduating university and needing a job. Uh, yeah, what's your degree in? Politics. So. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh, I cool. was impressed with that. I would put it on a very solid good. I'd give it a three. Out of all these vegetarian scotch eggs I've had, it's probably the best. So four. Hey! <laughs> and, yeah, like exactly what he said. Out of all the vegetarian scotch eggs I have had, it's the best. It's a four. Oh, I really liked it. Yeah. I would have picked that up and not known that was vegetarian. We've got four, four, three. That puts us on three point yeah, seven. We've not had, we've not had a we've not had a full run of fours. No. So did you come from far, Rob? Uh, Portsmouth. <laughs> you came all the way from Portsmouth to review a Scotch egg in an abandoned shop. Yeah. All People do way. it. It <laughs> happens. Oh, I'm, I'm a mutual friend of yours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Tom Chitty. I was like, oh yeah. And he's like, yeah. Guess what he told me? I was like, what? Your room used to smell like cum. <laughs> <laughs> I was like. <laughs> Several times, and my room had a distinct odour, but you, you didn't. Were like, you were like, I've got a cold because there's so many tissues on your floor. That is true, 